For today's video, I'm going to be talking about um, personal ghost stories. I wouldn't say I've had, you know, major experiences, but there was a couple experiences that were really creepy. And it's Halloween time, so I thought, might as well share them. So, yeah, let's get into this and let's set the mood. And of course I'm hearing weird noises now. <laughs> okay, so for to start off, um, in my old house, I, <clears throat> like about like three times the entire time that I lived there, I heard this woman's voice like very faintly say my name. Like very faintly. But like I knew it was my name and I knew it was a woman's voice and I heard it, but I only heard it like three times the whole time that I lived there for like 15 years um and when we moved obviously I didn't hear it um until like just a couple weeks ago which it was weird because it wasn't even in the house we were it was me AJ and Hannah we were headed back home from my sister's house also we were just sitting in the car and Hannah was sitting like right behind me and I heard my name again in a woman's voice very faintly and I quickly turned around because I thought Hannah called me turn around and she's looking at me like what <laughs> and I'm like did you call my name she's like no I didn't say anything and I'm like oh, I swear I heard this woman's voice say my name and she's like nope and then they kind of just looked at me like okay I got a little you know scared and I remembered the old voice at my old house and I got really really creeped out and then we got home and a lot of things happened <laughs> I don't know if I can even remember them in order I don't know if I can remember all of them but I'm gonna try my best to tell this story because there's there's a there was a quite a few things that happened i came in and i you know put my coat away my bag down aj, AJ and hannah went outside in the backyard and my job was to do dishes so i started doing dishes and i was cleaning up from cookies because we ate cookies um <laughs> i was cleaning up the cookie pans and I thought I heard like a knock on the back door. So I thought it was like AJ wanting to get my attention. So I went out there, opened the door, opened the screen door and I looked out and I'm all like, what? And he's like, what do you mean what? I'm like, I heard you knocking. And he said, no, I wasn't knocking. And then while I was still talking to them, I heard a knock at the front door. <sighs> so I went, so I started like, I, I part of me was like, okay, that's probably not a real knock because I'm gonna keep hearing things. And so then I started like getting all worried and I told AJ, I'm like, okay, well, I'm just gonna go check the front door because I think I heard another knock. And he's all like, um, so he followed me in and I walked out and he's like, just telling me, oh my gosh, you need to calm down, just sit down, just chill, chill out. I look out the front door and nobody's there and then I start really freaking out so yeah I had a really freaked out night that night AJ was able to calm me down before I went to sleep so that's a good thing and then I hadn't really heard anything I haven't heard the woman's voice since but I'm really worried that I'm going to hear it sometime soon and like every time I'm in my room with the lights off like now <sighs> um i just i kind of just sit there like all quiet thinking i'm gonna hear it again and i'm really worried because since i've heard it here too like not here but like in the car <sighs> i'm worried that something is 
you know, attached to me or following me. Um, I've never really had anything bad happen to me. I know I've had a few experiences in the house, but they weren't like scary. But I knew somebody was there. Like when I was cleaning the bathroom and I felt somebody behind me, like I knew and I saw their shadow. I saw a shadow and I turned around and nobody was there. I even said, huh? When I turned around and nobody was there, nobody was around or anything. But I didn't really get a bad feeling from it, honestly. I've talked to Hannah and Brian about it. Brian doesn't really believe in ghosts, but Hannah does. And she said that she doesn't really get anything downstairs, but we feel like a lot of things upstairs, which is kind of weird and backwards, but it's our honest opinion is that we've only had experiences upstairs, not much downstairs. I mean, downstairs still does creep me out because of spiders, but that's it. <laughs> and I think Hannah did tell me about one experience that she had downstairs, but she wasn't really scared. She felt like she knew them. I think she said it felt like my grandpa, the one that just died, like, a year. yeah, just a little over a year ago, he died. And she said that it felt like him. And I know my grandma feels him all the time over at her house. <clears throat> I've never felt him. I remember one time at my old house, um, like years, years, years ago, I think I felt and saw my other grandpa from my mom's side. Because the one that just died a year ago was my dad's side. But from my mom's side, um, he died like, I can't remember. It was a long time ago. Um, but like he like died like I think the day before Halloween or something I don't know but yeah I think I saw him after you know he died and in like my backyard and so I don't know I mean like yeah I've, I guess I've had a few experiences but most of them aren't scary I mean, except for that one night that I explained at the beginning of this, <laughs> that everything like creeped me out and I was so scared. But most of the time here, I just, I never really feel anything in my room. I'm just scared I'm going to hear that woman's voice again. So that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. If you have any ghost stories, share them. I would love to hear them. I love ghost stories. I love them. Even if they're bad or even if they're good, I still want to hear it. it it's, it's very interesting to me. Okay, so for today's shout out is Moonsif L, whatever. Uh, I don't know how to say it, but you know who you are. I'm going to put your Twitter at the end of the video like I always do. Um, yeah, thanks for the support. Uh, subscribe. If you haven't already, please subscribe to Kirby and Shay. We, ha we are having a video come out this Wednesday. And then we're having another video come out on Halloween because that's the Wednesday after that. And that's kind of like, that's going to be like a goodbye video because if you guys didn't watch my vlog, I am moving to Wyoming with AJ. And so it was kind of like a goodbye video. But yeah. Please like, comment, and share. I love you guys. Bye.